Now we're working. Okay, my other um, memory card didn't have no daggone memory left on it, so we were struggling, but we are here. What up, gangsters? It's your girl, India's Journal, back again once I almost forgot my intro. What up, gangsters? It's your girl, India's Journal, back again once again with another video. So today, as you can see by the title, we are about to get... We're not gonna get naked. We're just gonna take makeup off. So anybody who came here with any other intentions, it's not what's about to happen, okay? You're nasty. While we talk about, um, I mean, while I take, take off my makeup while I go naked face on you guys, um, actually, before we get started, if you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe, turn your post notifications on because I do not upload consistently. So you might want to know when I come back on, you know, come back in the scene, on the scene, step up on the scene, you know what I'm saying? So go ahead and subscribe and turn on your post notifications. Like the video just because I got this good energy here for you and I know you're vibing with me right now. So just go ahead and like the video, comment what you want to see down below. And without further ado, let's get started. Started. I'm gonna make it kind of interesting for you guys for all my gal guys and gals that have been um, Keeping up with my face um, Cleansing routine, but as you guys know, I do my three-step process with um, Clinique with the oily to oily um, Skin cleanser um, and it comes with the skin cleanser the um, What is it called? Do I have it? It's the skin cleanser, the exfoliator, and the um, gel moisturizer. So, I just want to give you guys an update. I already cleansed my face today, but then after I cleansed my face, I decided to put some makeup on. And so now I can't blame it on my makeup being from, you know, the drugstore, the beauty supply store. I actually have high-end makeup now. So if my makeup isn't applying right, I know it's because my skin is breaking out and I know it's not because of anything else. My skin has been getting so much better. Okay, so speaking of, this is how I'm looking so far. Let me zoom in for you guys. Lashes, I guess those are real. Speaking of that face um, cleanser that I'm using, a couple things that I've realized. Number one, when you're using the first one, one thing that I, I've learned to do, I don't know how, if it's going to help anybody else, but it helps me. And if you're not sure about what I'm talking about, just make sure you just go ahead and go back and watch the first, maybe first two or three videos. So you guys can be up to date on what the heck I'm even talking about. When you use the first um, step, and I'll show you guys which ones I'm talking about. So this here is the first step. Um, when you put it on... It goes on uh, trans translucent like you can see it I mean I mean you can't see it <laughs> but give it about five seconds it's gonna start drying and not drying to like really really bad like I would say five to ten seconds but you're gonna start feeling it kind of getting stiff guts kind of getting stiffer when you rub it in after that five to ten seconds then you're gonna start noticing that it's gonna that it's like turning white like a white color and I noticed that I feel more of the penetration when it's like I feel like penetrating my skin like I feel like I don't know if it's like maybe when I put that first like layer on and I rub it in and get it in really good you know mixed with the warm water it does a really good job and then when I let it sit for a little bit I feel like it's like bringing everything out and I start rubbing it again and then um once it gets like a little too stiff then I'll rinse it off if you guys are looking to buy in it no I'm not promoting I mean, I'm promoting in a way, not on purpose though. Like, I'm not sponsored by Clinique. I'm just, there's no reason for me to lie. This is like my genuine, op genuine opinion. Oh, another thing that I wanted to tell you guys. When using step two, which is the exfoliator. So in my videos, um, if you go back and watch them, which I'm hoping that you do, so you'll know what I'm talking about. You'll notice that I put the exfoliator on using a cotton ball. Now, I don't know what it is, but I recommend using a t-shirt. So I was down in North Carolina, realized I had my cleanser, I had my exfoliator, I had my gel lotion, 
all for my face but when i used my exfoliator i didn't have any cotton balls with me so i was like you know what let me use one of my clean shirts it's like regular like t-shirt and i used that so i think what it is is that when you use a cotton ball it's cotton it's gonna suck up more product and as you guys can see i've used this maybe i'm gonna round it off to seven times because i actually forgot how many times like i don't even know what day this is to be honest i've used quite a bit of product for seven days and i think it's because i was using it with the cotton balls and then i was using two cotton balls at that and then i stopped doing two and i went down to one cotton ball and even then i felt like i was using a lot of product but when i used the t-shirt I promise you guys one it just felt better on my skin I felt like I wasn't leaving little pieces of cotton all over my skin and I just felt like the product was spreading evenly in my skin um so I would definitely if you can if you feel comfortable doing that to definitely use a t-shirt for the exfoliator which again is the step two like I've always I always hear people say oh do this with a t-shirt do this with a t-shirt don't do this with a towel like for natural hair I've heard that you're it's better to dry your hair using a towel I mean using a t-shirt versus using a towel I never understood the reason why um maybe because the towel sucks up a lot of the you know moisture and the conditioners and stuff that you put in your hair I'm guessing but um yeah I'm thinking about doing a um, makeup look for you guys sometime soon. If you follow me on Instagram, you would see me. At, I use the uh, the my Fenty, all of my new Fenty Beauty products actually, um, and my Sephora stuff that I got. So um, just let me know if you want to see a makeup look. I've actually been practicing with this Fenty stuff and the new brush that I'm using and I did not I promise you guys I did not like it the first time and I mentioned that on my live on my Instagram live so make sure you guys follow me everything is right here on my social media handles are right there but yeah I did not like that I was very not impressed by the products but I said let me look up some reviews let me look up how exactly to use these things because it's like maybe I'm using them wrong. Second time that I did it, I really did like my makeup today. All right, so now that we are naked, I'm just going to show you guys what my face is looking like. And this isn't after a cleanse. This is just after me taking off my makeup to give you guys an update on how well the cleansers have been doing for my skin. I'm trying to make sure I have like everything off. This is um, what we're looking like. So here wait for it to focus you can still see i have my blemishes the blemishes haven't went away altogether but the biggest thing that i have noticed there is an evenness in my skin complexion that was not there before i still have a bit of dark circles around my eyes a little bit but not as bad as it used to be like I think I'm gonna insert like a clip or something so you guys can really see. And let me stand up so I'm a little bit more in the light. But um, I do, I, and I know that like I'm showing you the worst parts because I feel like the worst parts are what people are gonna point out the most. But my face was so much worse than this. Like this is, guys, when I tell you guys that this is like really, really, really good. Like. And it gives me a glow too. The um, new products, the clinic products that I've been using, it gives me a glow. And it's not a, oh my gosh, my face is so oily. I look like a glazed donut glow. It's a natural, like, fresh face glow. Yeah, guys, I just wanted to give you guys an update on that, on how my face has been doing. I am breaking out just a little bit um, because it's that time of the month. Yeah. And then on top of that, um, I have been like dabbling in a lot, a lot of makeup, especially while I've been traveling. Um, but yeah, guys, I just, I hope you like this video. Um, I just wanted to keep you guys, you know, like updated on what's been going on, especially with this routine, because this is honestly a journey for me. Like I've not had this bad of skin for like a very long, long time, probably since I was like in middle school. My, <sighs> yeah, the redness that I mentioned before I think I probably said it in one of those recent videos but the redness has definitely gone away um so I'm not that you know 
not my skin is not that irritated with the products now with like a lot of products and so my, my skin is actually handling a lot of stuff like a lot better now i can definitely say that thank you for riding out with me i know i'm really trying to be here for y'all and not just keep going mia on y'all so busy 2019 we're not gonna procrastinate okay i'm claiming it 2019 we're not gonna procrastinate we're gonna keep ourselves busy and we are going to get promoted speak it into existence all right guys comment down your new year's re resolution resolution um for the meantime i love you guys um keep riding out with me peace Oh yeah.